Hello. I had an experience with our, our lovely healthcare system uh, last Friday night uh, that leads to a proposal I have for um, for reform of, of healthcare. I went into an, to an urgent care clinic. I was having chest pain. Tip, incidentally, tell them you're having chest pain. You will move to the front of the line. I was having chest pain. I was certain, essentially certain, it was not a heart attack, and I told them that that it was from, um, from something I ate at lunch uh, that seemed to be, felt like it was stuck in my esophagus. So I, uh, so they took me to, to the back, um, hooked me up to an EKG machine, uh, did some blood work to verify that I was not having a heart attack or determine whether I was having a heart attack or not. And then they ultimately took a X-ray, uh, a chest X-ray to see if they could find, see something in, in uh, my esophagus that was stuck. <clears throat> so pretty basic stuff, EKG, uh, doctor visit uh, and chest x-ray and, and standard blood work. Uh, uh, in the midst of this, they, they came with a form uh, that uh, asking me to sign that appeared to say that I would uh, agree to pay whatever they charged me. So I asked what they would charge me for these procedures. They said they have no idea what they're going to charge me for these procedures. I asked if my insurance covered this. They said, we have no idea whether your insurance covers this. Seems pretty basic to me that they could know what they charge for an office visit, that they could know what they charge for a chest x-ray. Uh, but anyway, they refused to tell me that. I, I, I don't think it was a refusal. I think they honestly don't know because they charge everybody different amounts. <clears throat> uh, and they wouldn't even give me a range. Uh, so I refused to sign. Eventually, they convinced me to sign because I, I read it again. It appeared it did not say I'm agreeing to pay whatever you decide to charge me later. Um, uh, so I eventually agreed to sign, but I was afraid that I was signing that I agree to pay whatever you agree to charge me later. And you're not going to tell me what you charge me, but whatever the amount that you decide to charge me, no matter how high, I have to pay it. Uh, so anyway, uh, I, uh, that's, that's an unreasonable contract to ask people to sign. Um, so my proposal, <clears throat> uh, that I would submit to my jury, uh, to a, a citizen jury, if I'm elected governor, is uh, number one that ensure that that uh, healthcare providers have to charge the same amount to everybody, with, except for reduced fees for people with low income or uh, potentially reduced fees for low income or having uh, no insurance. But they have to charge all insurers uh, and and self payers the same amount. <clears throat> Number two, that they, add, that they have a list of what they charge for all of their procedures, or at least everything they've done more than five or ten times in the previous year. Uh, and, and that you can see that list when you walk into the office, you can see that list on their websites, <clears throat> what they charge for, for various procedures. And number three, that they tell that they are able to tell you whether they accept your insurance or not. They don't need to tell you what the copay is or all the details of your coverage, but just I don't think it's too much to, that they should be able to tell you whether they accept your insurance or not. So before you get a procedure done at a clinic, you know or have a pretty decent idea whether it's going to drive you to bankruptcy or not. So again, let's submit that to a jury. If the healthcare systems want to argue, as they do, that there's no way we can tell you how much procedures cost. It's just an unreasonable request. We have to make it up after the fact. And it's unreasonable for us to charge everybody the same amount. We want to charge un uninsured people more than we charge insurance insured patients. Um, if they want to make that argument to a jury, great. Good luck. Good luck convincing a jury that it's unreasonable for you to, to say what you charge for procedures. And good luck explaining to a jury why you want to charge uninsured people more, more than you charge insurance companies. But go ahead and make that argument. Let's have a jury hear this proposal to modify our health care system and see what they decide.